Hey guys, how's it going? So what you're looking at is something I ingeniously named the computer mouse. This is a completely functional computer inside of a totally 100% completely normal sized mouse. Basically, I designed a mouse in Fusion 360, printed it out, and then added a Raspberry Pi Zero, a 1.5 inch screen, a battery, and a keyboard. If you want more information on how I built this, just click right here. My original plan was to put all the components into an ordinarily sized mouse, but as you probably figured out, that didn't quite work out. This device features an epic folding screen, a pull-out keyboard, and all the buttons you would find on an ordinary mouse, including a scroll wheel. To turn it on, all you have to do is press this switch, and wait about 40 seconds for it to boot up, of course. Now that it's on, I'll show you what this thing can do. Even though the screen is attached to the mouse, the sensitivity of the mouse actually makes it not that hard to follow along with what's happening on the screen. Since this is using the Raspberry Pi Zero, it's not very powerful. So when trying to run things like Minecraft Pi Edition, the Pi Zero sometimes just freezes up. Most other applications though can be ran as expected. Typing on the tiny keyboard isn't actually as bad as it might seem, but it is kind of tricky considering the keys are so small and crammed together, and you have to have your hand in a very uncomfortable position. But as long as I held the mouse in place so the keyboard wouldn't move, typing on it wasn't even a challenge for me. Trying to play Minecraft with the mouse and sideways keyboard combo wasn't the easiest at first, but before long I could build masterpieces in a matter of seconds. Of course, after about 15 seconds of building, the pie would freeze. So the way I came up with this project idea was I saw a video where somebody put a Raspberry Pi into a keyboard and made kind of a plug and play computer out of it. And I thought, what if you tried to instead put a Raspberry Pi inside of a computer mouse? And then I thought, what if you added a screen and a keyboard to make it basically an entire laptop in the form of a mouse? So I looked into it and I couldn't find anybody else who did it, so naturally, I built it. When I started, I was thinking it was going to be super simple. Just gut a mouse, replace its sensors, buttons, and motherboard with those of a much smaller mouse, and then add in the main components. I guess I didn't really consider the fact that nothing in life is ever that simple, and for my plan to work, I was going to need one big mouse. And apparently, nobody makes giant mice, so I decided that I might as well just design my own. Which I'm actually really glad I did, because then I was not only able to better my CAD skills, but I was also able to design the mouse exactly the way I wanted it with all the room and spaces to accommodate the components. After the design and 3D printing was done, adding the parts wasn't actually too difficult, and it only took me a few days. Overall, I'm very happy with this project and I actually think it turned out a lot better than how I was imagining it was going to turn out when I was designing it. And even though this definitely isn't the most practical thing I've built, it's still one of my favorites. Thank you all so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. If you thought this project was neat, it'd be great if you could leave a like and comment. Thanks for watching, peace out.